We have another example. This time we have formula which says VCC equals IC times RC plus VCE and we are looking for RC. First, we have to check where is our RC. RC is on the right side of my formula multiplied to IC and the whole term is added to VCE. We have to move VCE to the other side of the equal sign. Why? Because it has no RC next to itself. So I'm going to simply move VCE to the other side. Remember, any time we are moving the variable or the number or the, or the whole term to the other side of the equal sign, we have to change the sign to the opposite. So in this case, I'm going to have VCC minus, because I'm changing the sign, VCE, and this is equal to IC times RC. I'm looking for RC. My RC, as we said before, is multiplied to IC. I do not want to have IC next to RC. So I have to eliminate multiplication by dividing both sides of the equation by the variable which is next to RC. In this case, I have IC. And IC and IC will cancel out and I'm going to end up with VCC minus VCE over IC equals RC. We can rewrite this formula and say RC equals VCC minus VCE over IC. Remember, anytime we move everything from right side to the left and everything from the left to the right, we do not change the signs. So that's why this is my answer.